não vai acabar essa lateral mesmo. Uma boca da boca, da boca, acho que é isso aqui. Uau! This is just beautiful. Welcome to the Vatican City, everybody. All right, guys, we're walking through this bridge towards the Castle Saint Angelo. Wow, this is just beautiful, man. This is at night, guys. It's just amazing. Wow. That's just amazing, guys. Castle Saint Angelo, or in English, or in English, Saint Angelo Castle. It's just amazing. Wow, that's sick. Amazing view, guys. <laughs> This is the Vatican City at night. Wow. This just looks amazing. Holy. Wow. That's insane. <laughs> This is just amazing. Wow. Buongiorno everybody. It's day two here in Rome, Italy. And we're at the Pantheon right now. Yes. Currently in the morning. I had the espresso before I head my way here. Beautiful scenery near the Pantheon. It's beautiful. Beautiful morning, guys. Their espresso was nice. I don't usually drink coffee, but it's Italy, man. You gotta drink coffee, cafe, espresso. So we're heading inside the Pantheon. And uh, the good thing about going on a trip on the weekdays, especially in Rome, is mostly of the sites you're going into are free. So no tickets are required. Tickets are required mostly in the holidays and uh, the weekend. Mostly the weekends. Holidays, I don't know. But that's why it said outside on the sign. But yeah, on the weekends, you have to pay for tickets. But on the weekdays, it's free. So go on the weekdays, guys. And we are in the Pantheon, guys. Wow, this is just amazing. Look at that. Wow. That's amazing. <laughs> That's crazy. Wow. That's the entrance, guys. Just amazing. It's beautiful. So as you can see guys, this is literally open, like open, like there's no windows up there, no tempered glass, it's literally a hole through here, and this is where it goes down, and I think that's a drain so when it rains, it'll just go through there, I think, I think that's a drain, right? Yeah, I think, I don't know, but yeah, if it rains, obviously it's not going to flood, so, since there's like an open hole up there. But yeah, it's sick guys. So, I'm about to head to the most tourist area ever in Rome. You guys ready? I think you guys already know from what you heard about Rome. Right? The most tourist place ever. Yep guys, the Trevi Fountain. The most 
tourist area ever in Rome. Look at this. I mean, today's just Thursday. It's not too bad, not gonna lie. It's just Thursday. It's not the weekend, so. Yeah, guys, Trevi Fountain. The most tourist area ever. Holy crap. Look at that. Look at this crowd. Holy. Yep. The Trevi Fountain, guys. I'm here. I guess I'm gonna be part of the part of the tourists too. <laughs> but no, nah, I'm not gonna lie, it looks very nice. Very nice, holy. Look at that, look at these statues. Damn, I don't know the history behind it, but it looks amazing. Holy, the water's clean. Wow. That these statues looks amazing. Damn. Wow. Just look at the details on these. Amazing. Wow. <laughs> Crazy. Yep, guys, that's the Trevi Fountain on a Thursday. It's not too bad, not gonna lie. All right, guys, as you, see, as you can see behind me, I just made it to the Spanish Steps. Yeah. It's pretty sick. I guess I'm gonna walk up there. Follow me along, walking up this, these stairs. Almost there guys, almost there, almost there. Alright, last few steps, last few steps. And there we are. We made it. Hey. <laughs> you have a view over here. That's my view guys. Beautiful. And I think that's the church over there. Yep. The Spanish steps. Alright guys, we made it to the Coliseum. After getting off the line, through security, we're finally here in the Coliseum, guys. Oh my gosh. This is amazing guys. This is the upper level of the Coliseum. Holy. As usual, lots of tourists. I guess I'll, I'll consider myself a tourist too. <laughs> yeah guys. That's a view. That's a view from up here. So this is the view where the audience see the fight and all I know about the Coliseum is from the Gladiator movie. Come on, everybody knows the Gladiator here. Right, so that's where I got a quick history from. So a quick history about the Coliseum would be, let's just say, over 2,000 years ago. Over 2,000 years ago, guys. Like, that's just insane how this Coliseum is still up till this day. But anyways, yeah, so... Over 2,000 years ago, uh, everybody, they didn't have social media back then, right? So in order for them to have, en have entertainment, this is where they get their entertainment. By watching these gladiators fight to the death. If you don't know who the gladiators are, they're basically prisoners. Um, where they just fight to the death inside the Coliseum down there. And this is where all the audience would be at they would be sitting up here witnessing the battle down there which is insane happy to be here especially after watching the gladiator directed by ridley scott i'm still in shock how this is still up till this day this whole coliseum pretty cool all right guys we are on the lower level of the coliseum Beautiful view. It's just beautiful. So we're on the lower level right now. And down there, 
This is where the gladiators fought to the death. So unfortunately, we can't go underground because you gotta have a green sticker, not an uh, orange sticker, but it's okay. The lower level and the upper level is all I need to witness the Coliseum. That's pretty much it. Like, I'm already near the underground, staying on the lower level, standing near the underground, and already got a view from up there where the audience sat and witnessed the gladiator fight to the death. Took a quick stop at a gelateria where they sell gelato. Man, they're the best, man. These are so good. And guys, got water too. Quick tip guys, when you're traveling anywhere, make sure you bring a water bottle. Don't be like me. I didn't bring a water bottle and I was so dehydrated after walking from my Airbnb and around uh, the city of Rome and then the Coliseum. I was so dehydrated guys, so like, make sure you bring a water bottle. Don't be like me. Bring a water bottle. Because again, water is free here in Italy, especially in Rome. So there's fountains everywhere. Make sure you grab a water bottle and refill. We're up top the Palatine Hill. Down there is the Roman Forum. Oh, there is the altar of the Fatherland. Behind it, behind the altar of the Fatherland. Yeah. All right, guys. I think we're making our way down to the Roman Forum now. Was up top at the Pantine Hill. Got a nice view up there for sure. One hundred percent nice view up there. Got to get to see you got to see the nice view of Rome. But yeah, anyways. Yeah, got another nice view down here too. Altar the fatherland. Oh, over there. Behind the altar the fatherland. Yeah. I guess we're making our way down to the Roman Forum. Guys. Super tired, holy crap. Good thing I bought a water bottle at the gelato store. And then there's fountains here too, guys. That's, again, best part, best thing about Italy. Water's free here, fountains everywhere. Grab your water bottle, fill it, and drink, man. Oh, that's it, that's it. <laughs> that's the dead end, guys. Okay, I gotta find a way to go down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 